Every year, Open Doors publishes the World Watch list to focus the world's attention on those 50 countries where Christians are persecuted the most. These are the five where the persecution of Christians is most severe. Pakistan. Christians in Pakistan continue to experience massive violence in the form of attacks and assaults. Moreover, blasphemy laws give Islamists in the country the opportunity to put Christians under massive pressure. If a Christian is accused of insulting Islam in any way, then his life is in danger. If he's not sentenced in court, in the event of his release, Islamists will follow and try to kill him. Sudan. Historically, Islam is deeply rooted in Sudanese society. Under the authoritarian rule of Omar al-Bashir and his party, there is no rule of law. Christians are sometimes arrested under suspicion of espionage. Some church buildings have been demolished, and recently, the government put enormous pressure on pastors and church leaders to place their churches under government control. Somalia. If a Muslim decides to become a Christian here, he runs the risk of being persecuted to death by his family and local rulers. In addition, Al-Shabaab fighters are specifically looking for Christians. Whoever is suspected of being a Christian will be killed. Afghanistan. Islamists have made territorial gains and thus increased the high pressure on the few Christians there. As soon as it is known that someone has accepted Christianity, society can threaten death and sometimes family can even carry it out. North Korea. Surveillance of North Korea's own population has increased because of the country's continued self-isolation. Ownership of a Bible puts whole families in danger. Tens of thousands of Christians are imprisoned in labour camps and many are tortured to death. To Kim Jong-un and his regime, Christians are enemies of the state. At the same time, however, Christian churches are growing underground and the gospel is spreading in secret.